Hi everyone and welcome day 41 in the Epic Heat program. Well done everyone so far. Today it is giant sets, the glutes. All you will need for today's workout is a dumbbell or two dumbbells or a giant kettlebell or a barbell, the heaviest weight that you've got if you can. The dumbbell that I'm using for your reference is 25 kg. You'll also need your booty band, your glute band, and also a chair for hip thrusts and perhaps a towel for just to place the dumbbell on. The timer is going to be on 45 seconds of work per exercise within the giant set. There is four exercises within each giant set and then we have 30 second rest. There is a staple in today's workout and it is this, our hip thrusts. As you can see, we're in full range. Then we go into half rep, sort of pulses. Then we try for the hold and then we're into our full range. That will appear three times in today's workout. We kick it off with some band work just to warm up before we go straight into those hip thrusts. So giant sets, this is a lot of volume. It is only 30 second rest. So primarily for this entire 30 minutes, you will be working quite a lot. By no means are you expected to do the whole four sets without pausing. Me personally, I'm going to try and make myself have to stop. So what I mean is when I'm doing my hip thrusts, I am really going to use the band. I know I say this every time, but I really just want to get this across. I could make it a lot easier if I didn't push against the band. I am pushing against the band and lifting as high as I can. So up and out. So basically it means it's a lot more intensive with the weight that I'm using and a lot more work is involved from the muscles. So really it is up to you to make this as challenging as you can. When it comes to the sumo squats and the sumo squat deadlifts, the feet are wider than squats and also toes are slightly out. You're going to keep your back flat at all times and you're going to lower as low as you possibly can. Keep the heels on the floor and lift through pushing through those heels. With the sumo deadlift squat, slightly different, you're gonna tilt forward that little bit as if you're gonna set the dumbbell down. But again, the hips are still gonna be pushed back. You're gonna keep the heels on the floor, chest is going to be open, and neck, try to keep it in line with your spine. So don't look straight up and don't look too far down either. This is pretty much constant work on the glutes. It is gonna be a challenge. I'm gonna make this 25 kg dumbbell feel twice, if not more, as heavy. In fact, this would probably be challenging enough body weight. So really make use of that band and also the depth of the squats and also the range of the hip thrusts. Knees out, hips up. If you need to pause, take as long as you need for the pause so that you can go back into that position safely and also you can still perform full range of movement. I think you're really gonna love this one. Your glutes will, let's go. Summer's gone, I'm latching on Don't even know your name But you're still in my head
We're moving through the night like we're from a different star Flying over streets and all broken hearts But they can't even touch us, we found a different beat Paradise is waiting and we bought the lead Ooh, getting caught in the mist, there's so many that never get out of They're feeding the fears and the doubts, ooh But we go and we run to the end and we run without shame What we got is timeless, we still proceed And we're holding the key Yeah, we're tight as 